Okay, so week two predictions. Obviously, for this week, we've had our, I think, five rewards, right? One, two, three, four. Yeah, five car rewards. And then, obviously, like, house, license plate, and room, I guess. Anyway, in around three to two days, whatever, we are going to have new rewards. Now, we know kind of one of the cars, because they kind of leaked it. And obviously, I'm pretty sure it wasn't actually meant to be leaked. It is the speed tail with the cool looking fade wrap on it or whatever. I'll put some like images on the screen. It looks kind of good, to be honest. Like it, I like the wrap. I hope you can color like both the different parts of the fade bit. So you can color the first bit or, and the second bit. I don't know. But that's the only car that is confirmed right now. There was some other images of the Cadillac. Obviously, Cadillac has not been added this week, and I don't know if they want to add, they meaning Cadillac, I don't know if they want to add the Cadillac in this update, or they're saving it for like a big initial release of lots of Cadillacs. I don't know what's going to happen with that, but we do know that there is a Cadillac on its way sometime. Don't know if it's going to be for week two. It could be. I don't know though. I don't know if they want to like... If there's any new brands, I don't know if they want them to be their own release. Now, going on to a brand that is probably not going to arrive, Koenigsegg. I would think that Koenigsegg wants their, like, release to be separate from other stuff. Really, I don't think Koenigsegg would want their cars to be with other cars. And also, if their Koenigsegg cars are coming, like, this week... That means they're limited, and I don't think Koenigsegg wants their cars to be literally hidden behind an event that won't happen, or like they won't come back. So, I don't know if Koenigsegg is coming this week, I highly doubt it. I think Koenigsegg is more for a release on something else, like an actual release, so the cars are in the dealership. There might be a few limited Koenigseggs, but I think more so that we probably are just not going to have it this event. We still could, but... Just don't get your hopes up for Koenigsegg, I'll be honest, but... Anyway, the last kind of car thing is a Humvee. Now, this was leaked with Cadillac and stuff like that. It was also leaked with the UFO. Obviously, the UFO is in-game. Um, devs, if you're watching this, please make this a little bit quicker. It's, it's honestly so slow. Anyway, so with this, there's a Humvee, and obviously because the whole event is alien themed, right? We go over and spawn the... where is that? Here we go. We go ahead and spawn this, right? This house is basically... Oh, this house is basically the 2023 Spookfest house, but it's alien themed. So like, you know, there's alien eggs, there's the alien craft, craft UFO, there's... Or oh, there's a UFO taking the roof off. This event is mostly alien themed. So getting a Humvee for like Area 51 or kind of stuff like that kind of does make sense. Now I don't know if they are actually going to add this as like a licensed one or if it's, like, if it's going to be an unlicensed fake kind of model. Don't know about that. It'd be kind of cool I guess to see a licensed Humvee but I don't know. But other than that, I think that's probably all the chance rewards we'll get. Some people was asking if we're going to get this UFO as, like, next week's prize. To be honest, I don't see a point in getting three UFOs in-game. Also, this UFO doesn't really have, like, an interior. Or, it's literally just, like, this. There's nothing to it. If it did get added, I don't... I wouldn't mind it. But, like, we have a UFO that's... Like classic and then we have like a normal UFO when you think of a real life UFO. The only thing is this is slow and the other one's fast. But other than that, yeah. Um I don't think I don't know if there's any gonna be anything else. There was the alien eggs in here, if you as you can see. Uh I don't know if this actually means anything though. It's literally just alien eggs. I think they just put this in there because like, you know, alien themed event. You can drive these, which which is kind of cool, um, I don't know, the alien stuff, but yeah, mostly, like, we're gonna get the speed tail that was leaked, maybe Cadillac arrives this week, and then maybe the Humvee releases this week, Cadillac, I still don't know, Conan's eggs, I highly doubt, L I'll just say now, because I think they would want this separate release, but, um, 
yeah, I think for week two, we're only going to get cars. I don't think we're going to get, like, another house release or stuff like that. We could get another rim, but other than that, I don't know. That's basically it for this video. They might buff the race because it's the last, like, week. Where is that at? They might buff it because it's the last week, and they might want people to, you know, do the race and grind or stuff like that. Um, they might buff, like, the rate, like, the stuff you get from the alien crates. I don't know. I think if they did buff the race a little bit, just to help, because it is, like, the last week of the event, it would make sense, but no confirmation on that. We'll have to just basically wait and see, but other than that, seems like it's going to be a good week two. It's not going to be as big as week one, obviously, but you'll still be able to get week one rewards it's not like they'll go away it's just that more rewards will be added on so you still have two weeks to get all of the rewards one week to get the week two rewards obviously but tell me what you think about week two and what cars you think will arrive as you know at the moment we don't know um they haven't sent any teasers out and i don't know if they will they could like maybe thursday or something like maybe wednesday tomorrow i don't know but we'll have to wait and see like I said, tell me what you think about week two and, you know, what cars are coming and have a good day.